To begin, you will need 12 end portal frames and 12 eyes of ender. Next, you will need a 3x3 area to place the portal around. This red square will be used as a demonstration of how much space you need. It's very important that you place the end portal frames in the correct direction. To help your chances of your portal working correctly, stand inside it when building. If you look closely at the end frame design, you will notice there are two marks connected to the main square of the frame. These marks need to be facing a certain direction for the portal to light up. For the top and bottom of the portal, make sure to place the frames with the marks facing up and down. As for the sides, make sure that the marks are facing sideways. Once you've placed all the frames, your portal should look like this. Now you can go ahead and place an IF Ender in each frame. If your portal does not work, try rebuilding it and trying again, and make sure you're standing inside the portal while doing so.